so as i discussed in the previous videos that uh, we are going to start uh, the series related to the pro uh, competitive programming and this complete series will be uh, based on uh, giving you a push or you can say uh, making you prepare for the uh, placements or interview preparations and uh, here in this series we are also going to cover the competitive programming so the core subjects which we will be covering is java programming uh, that is the basic fundamentals of java programming because i think uh, we need to study one object oriented programming language then after studying the basic fundamentals of java programming we will be studying the concepts related to the competitive programming like uh, we have dynamic programming but uh, for gate examination the questions related to the dynamic programming they are very limited you, you are going to have only a fixed number of questions there are only five to six concepts they ask from dynamic programming but still there are approximately i have uh, 30 to 50 examples set to the dynamic programming so we are going to cover all those examples and most of those examples are not even asked in gate examination so uh, to do have a thorough study of the complete course we need to cover all those concepts thoroughly so uh, so what uh, the plan is like we are going to study the java programming first and after java programming we are going to jump to uh, dynamic programming and the applications uh, or some examples of dynamic programming for uh, so that we can start competitive programming and after uh, taking those examples see th they are approximately 50 examples so those 50 examples they are going to take approximately somewhere around 500 uh, sorry 100 uh, or 120 hours because every concept will take two hours to explain and after taking those examples we'll be taking some uh, questions from uh, the the websites where you do competitive preparation like we have code chef we have uh, the other website so we are going to take some programs from the beginner to medium level uh, uh, concepts from those websites and we'll try to solve these questions so i'm planning the content in such a way that we'll be doing somewhere around one or two live classes um, in a week where you can ask me the questions related to uh, the doubts which you have and um, or uh, I'm going to provide you videos approximately every week I'm planning to give you videos of somewhere around 10 to 15 hours and um, the total duration of this complete course will be around 6 months because uh, it will take us uh, uh, no, approximately um, uh, somewhere around 20 days to 30 days to cover Java programming so I'm going to cover everything in a very thorough manner very thoroughly and after doing the Java programming we are going to cover uh, the programming concepts uh, which uh, which are related to algorithms and dynamic programming uh, which will take somewhere around uh, two months and uh, then we are going to cover some examples of uh, the previous uh, previous questions in competitive programming we are going to take some examples which are asked in uh, yahoo uh, interview or facebook or google or twitter so there are some students who prepared for uh, these courses so i'm going to you know uh, i'm going to cover those questions and uh, by the end uh, so we will we'll be prepared so much that we will be you know uh, will be able to cover uh, these examinations very easily and there's one more branch after studying the java programming either you can prepare for competitive programming or i'm going also going to start a course related to android application development so after covering the java programming concepts java programming fundamentals then you have a choice either you can go for android application development or you can go for competitive programming so both are having both these things uh, no both of them are uh, kind of a slightly different domain because in uh, android application development you are preparing for a specific type of job that means you have already chosen that you are going to become a uh, you know, application developer uh, or case mobile application developer but for competitive programming the uh, good companies top companies they they take their the candidates on the basis of how they are going to perform in their uh, examination right so we are going to do that so the contents of this complete course related to the java programming as as follows so we'll be initially we are going to cover the fundamentals or you can say the language fundamentals where uh, we are going to discuss about what are the different data types are there and uh, some concepts related to arrays and um, okay then we are going to cover uh, concepts related to operators and assignments then we'll be covering the concepts related to declaration and access control after the access control we'll be covering the concepts related to the flow control in java then we'll be covering exception handling then assertions then we'll be studying object oriented concepts then we are going to study what is the inner class then threads and concurrency control and uh, fundamental of java then fundamentals of java language package 
then the collection framework uh, and generics then we are going to cover file input output and serialization after the file input output and serialization we are going to cover garbage collection uh, after the garbage collection we are going to cover some new features of java programming language like we have enum for each loop we have a var arg method we have uh, auto boxing unboxing etc then we will be studying internationali internationalization and uh, some examples of that so after studying this course you will be able to crack the examination which is scjp and ocjp scjp is java uh, sun certified java developer uh, java programming professional you can say and uh, and then you will also be, uh, be able to clear the examination related to ocjp right so that is oracle certified so the for some certified uh, professional for java you can you can say it like this and you can also you'll also be able to clear ocjp so the syllabus which i am discussing here this syllabus due to the certification examinations from scjp uh, from sun sun microsystems and the oracle so we are going to cover that okay so let us first start uh, with the first chapter that is the la java language fundamentals and here in these chapters i'm not going to uh, i'm not covering about how to install this uh, install the software you can do the simple installation on your system you have to install a software that is uh, netbeans most of the programming we are going to do that that will be on netbeans so uh, I, I'm, we are not going to program on notepad so i prefer programming in netbeans directly rather than performing notepad so my main uh, aim is to make you understand the concepts and make you clear the you know uh, interviews so we are going to cover some interview questions interview uh, the kind of questions they asked in interviews and uh, then uh, we'll move on to the next sections like this okay so if you want access to this course you can always email me um, on my email id that is lectures by himanshu at gmail.com or you can always call us on our contact number that will be shown in this video and um, uh, you can get access to these videos from there and um, uh, the videos on YouTube, they will be somewhere. We are going to cover, put somewhere around 20% of the videos of the entire subject on YouTube, and if uh, you can take the entire course through uh, through the link. Okay, so now let us start with the first chapter, that is the Java language fundamentals.